Hey, 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 post Merry Christmas, everyone. Got a Redbubble video review. I haven't done one of these in a while. Most of these are gifts for other people, ergo why it's coming out after Christmas. Cause I didn't want to spoil anything. We're gonna talk about a few things that I got. So we're starting off with a mug and, oh, of course it's a little, uh, yeah, I've been using this a little bit. <clears throat> you might not recognize it until I fully turn it. Still don't get it? How about that? This is a Sp Into the Spider-Verse, based off of this poster. If you might have seen a few of these posters of Miles falling upwards, but downwards towards the city, because as you can see, that's New York. So this is actually a really good traveler's mug. One, you can put this in the dishwasher and the artwork is not damaged at all. As you can see, there's a solid ring around it so the artwork doesn't get affected and it actually does a real good job at insulating whatever you've got in there, whether it be your coffee or hot cocoa. The sealant on the top here, this is actually a pretty darn good seal. To the point where actually, if you haven't taken the lid off in a little while, it actually is a little bit difficult to take off. Overall, this is a damn good mug that just so happens to have an absolutely amazing artwork and you can put this through the dishwasher. You have no idea how good that is, considering how often I forget my mugs in my car and then they smell. And of course, I will be putting the links to these items in the description. So if you wanna buy these yourself, that piece of work is by Fresh Fruit fresh fruit. It's called Not Falling But Rising. Next thing up on the list is another Traveler's Mug. Now this one might be a little bit difficult to see considering it actually doesn't have much artwork on it except right here. Now it's a little bit hard to read but it says you shall not pass. And that is Gandalf fighting the Balrog. Now admittedly when I got this I thought that this would be a little bit bigger or a little bit more visible and considering the rest of this is just a black mug i'm a little bit upset by that but again the quality of the traveler's mug once again metal in the inside just a fantastic mug while the artwork is not as as good as a display as I was hoping it would be, it's still a really good product. This one is called the Wielder of the Flame of Anor and it is made by Hey Vixen Designs. Now I've never gotten pillows or anything of the sort from Redbubble, so this is a learning experience admittedly. This is a Red Dead themed pillow. As you can see, it's not that big. I was hoping for maybe about this here and also it doesn't come with a pillow it's actually a zipper one here now this one is made by balder h uh, but i will admit it's a really nice quality as long as you get a nice small pillow in it which i did um, this is a gift for a friend as well if you find a nice little pillow for it it's not as big as you would think this is a throw pillow and the dimensions are 40 by 40 centimeters that was a little bit of a disappointment I, again i was hoping for a little bit bigger but the quality is really good the artwork is really good there's no stretching there's no like kind of tears in the threading i'm actually pretty impressed with how good this looks and now the last thing on the list, and this was the one that was the biggest surprise, and I kind of wish I had gotten this for myself now. This is also not falling, but rising by Fresh Fruit, and this is a travel bag. This is awesome. This thing is huge. Look how big that is. That's a huge drawstring bag. Most of the ones that I've had are about half of this size, and look at the quality. The quality is fantastic. These are strong ropes. Again, this is almost double the size of what every single drawstring bag I'm used to. It's got extra rope if you need to tighten it or loosen it. It has a pretty great drawstring bag. It even has a zipper in it. There's a little zipper pouch here. Look at this. This is where you can put your joints. I mean your money. Yeah, that's pretty deep. Look at that. I got my whole hand in this little thing. Gosh damn it. I wish I got this for myself now. So again, that is Not Falling But Rising by Fresh Fruit. This is a drawstring bag. I would definitely, definitely recommend this. Anyways guys, those are the products I got from Redbubble during the Black Friday sale. They were also Christmas gifts. The Spider-Verse travel mug is mine, but the other ones are gifts, and I hope that those who receive them enjoy them. Particularly the Flame of Anor and the pillow, I was expecting just a little bit more, so I hope they forgive me for that. But otherwise, these are all really great products, and as I said before, the links are in the description below. Honestly, Redbubble has continued to be really good at improving their products. They're always really good at quality assurance checking, and they're also really good at their customer service in terms of getting back to you because these things were 
gone for quite a while and I didn't know where they were and they were able to help me out as best they could in terms of locating where it was. Eventually it arrived just yesterday so I'm happy about that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did leave a like and if you should more subscribe. Next time there's a sale I am gonna get this. I am pissed that I didn't get this for myself now. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Nitz and you might remember me from the animated cult classic TV show Undergrads. It's been a while, but I'm happy to say The Click is finally getting back together in an all-new movie, thanks to a successful Kickstarter campaign. But we are still asking for your support. To see any and all updates about the upcoming Undergrads movie, be sure to check out and like the Bring Back Undergrads Facebook page. And with any luck, we'll see you guys soon.